Hello and welcome to Beersuckers.com. Um, we got another one from you. Um, ben brought this one. It's nice shoe. It sounds good to me. <laughs> it's a limited edition 2008 ale brewed with spices. Um, it's 10% alcohol by volume. It says it's a limited edition brewed only with one, brewed only once each winter by Brasserie, Brasserie, Brasserie de Chouf, Brasserie de Chouf, in the heart of the. Okay, I'm confused. Okay, <laughs> it's brewed in the woods in Belgium. <laughs> yeah, brewed in the woods in Belgium. <laughs> Says they've been brewing this in Texley Complex bottle conditioned ale since 1993. All right, and again, this is the nice Chouffe or Chouf or you know if you explicitly know how to say it. Yeah, let us know. Um, I think there is a gentleman out there that uh, reviews tobacco that is from Belgium, so he probably can tell us a little more about it. All right. Okay, it's got a neat little orange cap with a little elf on it, just carrying some twigs. So, uh, and it's foaming out of the bottle. Pretty neat. All right, let's go for the pour. We got a little wine glass here. So, let's give it a shot, see what we get. A big sound it makes coming out of that bottle. Hmm. Oh, very nice, very nice. That's a nice color. Got a nice head. Um, looks good, dark, rich amber color. Looks black on the film, but it's kind of an amber, dark color. Looks to be nice beer. Um, says beer is supposed to be around 60 degrees Fahrenheit. Ours is right around 50 or so. Um, it is an ale, so it should bring out some more flavors as it warms up here, so we try it. Um, and again, it's got an off-white head, some really nice bubbles, um, not a lot of lacing. It didn't seem to stick to the side of my glass, but it does seem to hold the head pretty well. Um, smell. A lot of orange. Yeah, it's, it's citrusy kind of smelling. You do you do get the, the it's kind of an orange peel kind of smell. Um, it's almost similar to the Affligem Noel. It, it's uh, not not as warm, right? But it's 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 got the same kind of wintry welcome to it. At ten percent. This is 10% alcohol by volume. I, I would have expected a little more alcohol smell. Yeah, it's, it's, the alcohol is not really strong smelling. The Belgians do do a good job of, you know, blending everything well with you, it. You get a slight hint of the alcohol, but it's not, it's not overpowering like you think it would be in 10%. Not strong smelling. Oh, um, mm -mm. all right. Cheers. Malty. It, it, it is quite malty. Um, lots of the candied fruit flavors. Um, that little orange, little little citrus, little little um, almost a fig flavor, kind of wandering around in there, but quite malty. Uh, I, I didn't expect the malt that it would have, but it, it's pretty pretty upfront with that. Yeah, I definitely, I definitely got the figs and that, and that draw on it. 
You know one thing I like about the beds? They still retain their beer. Yeah. It, it tastes like beer, you know. Some of these stronger ales and some of the stronger versions of some of the beer we've had <clears throat> start to lose their beer character, but this still tastes like a malty beer. So, yeah. 